This is Unreal Engine Build London 16. This is the first time we've brought together enterprise users of Unreal Engine into one space. It's a mixer, we've got great demos here, and some awesome inspiring speakers. Last year we started our Feel Wimbledon campaign and the aim was then and still is to try and bring that atmosphere and emotion out to fans wherever they are. They brought all of the best of the UK and actually Europe together to shine a light on the best experiences out there. We've now seen an explosion in use of Unreal Engine in enterprise. That means architecture, aviation, automotive, medicine, data visualization. We've got some of the best agencies in the world that are delivering these amazing experiences on behalf of their clients. This event is all about bringing those people together. It's exciting. You have small companies who uh, really couldn't have been part of the um, enterprise market space before. But now with UE4, um, you can have small companies jumping into this space, providing enterprise services uh, in a way that just wasn't possible before. So an event like this is fantastic, uh, both for networking and just to, to see the direction everything is going. VR is about the content, and it's about the thing that these people want to see. The hardware does nothing. They're intelligent screens, and that's it. They just happen to know where they are in space. So people need to create amazing content and tell amazing stories. What excites me most is the, the creativity that's coming out of the space. Um, every day I'm surprised by new and unique ways that people are using this amazing real-time engine technology to do awesome things. Now we've used a variety of game engines over the years and now we've gotten to the point where uh, UV4 is baked into our pipeline almost exclusively. And we said, oh, we're going to do it, do it on headsets. It was like, no headsets. Technology's got to be invisible. Make it totally simple for the kids to get on the bus and take, you know, uh, enjoy this experience and be transported to Mars. We've been following the developments in Unreal since it became free last year. The guys were using UDK many, many years ago. Um, and this is just a perfect opportunity for us to showcase what people are able to do in property. Everyone seems to be very open to talk about what it is they're doing, um, sharing their experiences, what, you know, what they like about the software, um, ideas on features and how to develop it. It's, um, it's very collaborative. We started Realities last December um, and our vision is to make real world places explorable that were out of reach before. So all those cool amazing places you know that are too far away, you don't have the time, you don't have the funds to go there, they might be off, for, uh, off limits for the general public. We want to make explorable in VR. The rising tide of all of us producing better work is going to float everybody up and I can't wait to see what the next 12 months brings. Bye.